Hello, in this video I will speak about how to pull images from uh, a private hardware Docker registry image to the Kubernetes cluster. But before going to the topic, I will show you what I have done and how to create a hardware registry. This, top, this video is about uh, pulling images from hardware, hardware but before going uh, to the topic, I will explain briefly how to bootstrap the hardware registry. I will show, I will uh, share this code in the below description, and you can find uh, this code in the video description. How to install Docker in uh, Ubuntu twenty two also how to install hardware and run uh, without certificate on port 80. I've downloaded uh, the hardware and let me show you. Here is the I've downloaded uh, hardware offline, extract it, and here in hardware YAML file, I've commented port 8, port HTTPS, and, all, and only use port 80. After commenting it, I run install a script after running this script you will have some container running and on port on port 80 you will have access to the hardware after running it you have to create a project as you can see here i created a microservice project also i have created a user here and in the project, you can see this user is a member of this project. After running this on your host, you have to log in to the harbor. And after um, to, to log in, you have to provide a username and password. After providing a username and password, you will have a authentication for your hardware and we will use this in our Kubernetes cluster to push images from the hardware.local. Also, in all hosts, I set up host hardware.local in my host file so I can have access to the harbor.local using name instead of IP address. So let's go and see how to configure private registry for Kubernetes cluster. Here I have a Kubernetes cluster. This is my cluster and I have a harbor running on virtual machine. As you can see here, all of this scenario is running in the virtual box host. Okay, uh, let's see uh, what happens if uh, we try to pull images from a hard private registry. Here I have a, let me change the name. Here I have a YAML file and uh, I've configured my master node to, for, to pull images from private registry, but I didn't configure my worker node. And when I try to pull images from private registry, let's see what's happened. As you can see here, 
I don't have any I don't have anything running inside the microservices namespace and if I try to let me see if I try to run pod in worker node and pull images from the hardware registry let's see what happens it is pending it is pending let's see why what's happening inside the pod okay i change it as you can see i change it to kubernetes io host name and to my log selector has a problem and i solved it and if we look at the pod you can see the error is image pull backup and if we look at the pod we see server give http response to the https client so uh, let's see how to resolve this problem although if i to delete it and run it in my master node you can see it will pull images and run it let's see um, how to resolve this problem at first i want to show you we should configure the i'm using container d we have to configure the container d and add these line to the container d configuration and solve the problem these two line and this line so uh, let's go and see here i have to ssh to my host this is my work to worker mode and if i look at This is the container de deconfiguration. I will make a backup of this file and open container deconfiguration. Here I will search for registry and as i showed here in the config i have to say use and say to i have to skip verifying the set field. below the configuration here what is this key when you log in to Harvard Docker login, when you log in to Harvard, provide using the username and password you created in the Harvard. Here I created this user and using this user, I used this user to log in to the Harvard registry. After login, you will have this key here in the config.json file. So this use this key.
key and configure it here. Also, in, in the mirror section, I have to That's it. After configuring container D, I have to restart container D. And here you can see get file dash all. As you can see, it's running on master node and if I delete it and run it on my worker node let's open the file and change it Let me show you. I've changed the host name to my worker node, which we had problem running, pulling images from my private hardware registry. And if I apply, you can see the container is creating on worker node and it's running perfect.